Hello YouTube, this is Bronco doing a Reach Track review. Um, a Boy the Milkman special. Um, this is like the Duquesne 238 special. Um, has a compilation of some of his videos and this is a race track, obviously from the track view, but I like all of his tracks because they're nice and big and they're smooth and the turns are wide. Here, I don't know what I was doing, but um, overall his tracks were nice, um, smooth, Checkpoint wide turns. Reach. And another thing I like is that he incorporated the use of both track and um, ground racing, so you have you get a little Checkpoint bit of both. Reach. So, and um, I don't know if I said reach. this, but this track is called Beach Line. And the way that I'm, uh, I don't, I didn't know um, Boy to Milkman before a couple of days ago, because when I put up my Duquesne 238 special, I um, he commented Checkpoint on it, asked me reach. if I would review one of his videos, and so I checked out his channel, and um, I really liked his videos, so I decided that I'd review a couple of them, and then. When I actually raced them, they were there. Uh, I liked Checkpoint them a lot, so I decided reach. to do a um, s compilation of all of his videos and review them for him. So, um, yeah, Boy to Milkman, if you're watching, um, good job. But back to the note of uh, when he commented, Checkpoint if you're gonna reach. comment, um, or actually, if you Checkpoint would like reach. me to review your Lab videos. Complete. Just send me a message on YouTube with a link or um, a video attached, and I'll watch it and uh, maybe check out your channel. And um, if I'll probably download it, and if I like it, I'll review it. I I review a lot of tracks, good or bad, so you don't worry if it's not the best track. I'll still give it a look. This track is called Bottleneck. I like this one a lot. It's uh it's sort of like Beach Line. It's um big wide turns uh, nice and smooth it also Checkpoint it doesn't reach. use the ground track as much it doesn't use the ground Checkpoint as much for racing reach. but it still does um, use it a little bit actually I don't know if it uses Checkpoint it at all this reach. race no this one this one doesn't oh there it is so it doesn't use as much ground racing but it still has some Checkpoint reach. but this is um I like this track a lot. It's nice and smooth and um, pretty one-directional. What I mean by that is, you know, like in the last video there was an intersection where you didn't really know, like, if there wasn't like an arrow or a wall there, you wouldn't really know which way to go. So I like this one because, you know, you pretty much follow the, the yellow brick road. But that just wraps up this, this um, that track. This one is called Frigid Rails, <clears throat> and in the description it said that uh, he made this around Christmas time, so this one has a Christmas theme to it, I guess. Um, it's not as much of a, I mean it's still a race, but it's kind of more of a scene track where you see the things that he built. There's a Christmas tree right there, you have to be careful because you might run underneath it. Checkpoint but reach. this track's kind of short, but it's still good for racing. It's not that difficult, so if you're kind of a beginning Checkpoint racer, reach. it's good. There we just passed a candy cane. Checkpoint reach. So, you know, as I said before, it was made around Christmas, so if you're in the Christmas mood, I guess give this track a Checkpoint try. Reach. Um, it's March right now, so you might not race this one for a while. Checkpoint reach. But, I mean, even though this is not really a reach. big racing track, it still has nice smooth turns and uh, good effort put into it. Reach. So this Lap is complete. just about the end of this Lap track. Over. This next one is called Maritime Mountain, and I apologize reach. for the video being dark. He, uh, he put a special Checkpoint effect, I think reach. it's, I don't remember the name of it, but... Um, when I record it on my capture card, it makes it uh, makes it look darker than it is. Checkpoint so if you reach. download to Xbox Live, it won't be this dark. It'll um, you can actually see where you're going. But 
this track in the description that says it has a big drop in it and the drop um, at the end is is at the end so um if you really want to utilize it the best um, I suggest doing maybe two or three laps and this track checkpoint reach it uses a lot of ground track and because it's dark you might run into rocks occasionally but reach. Um, overall it's kind of clear uh, the ground isn't reach. cluttered um, going up that staircase it's checkpoint nice and smooth reach. so you don't have to worry about rolling coming off the top here's the big jump and the jumps nice and reach. smooth you don't roll Lap coming complete. off of it or fall Round off the side over. So I definitely recommend the Maritime Mountain. This track is called the Towers, and although this track isn't very long, it is definitely a challenge because um, it feels like you're going to fall off the whole time. So when you're going around in circles, um, it's kind of slanted downward. So up here you'll see. But um, so going around this curve. It uh, feels like you're going to slide off, so you should definitely ride the, the high lane so you don't slide off like I did a couple of times. But going around this, it, um, it, like, it feels like you don't know where you're going because the uh, track kind of loops around underneath the track, so you can't really see like if the track turns in front of you, so definitely be careful for that. Um, this next track is called Ye Old Valley Route. And I think this is one of my favorite maps that he's made. Um, it uses a lot, it utilizes a lot of ground track, um, but it still has the um, regular track. And it's like I said on all of his tracks, it's uh, nice and big and wide. But <coughs> excuse me, as I've seen before, um, I don't know if I said this, but. If you want me to review one of your videos, send me a link or a video or a message with a video attached, and um, I'll check it out. And if I like it, I'll uh, do a review for it and put it on my channel. Because this is how I uh, this is how I found Boy to Milkman, and he's his videos don't have that many views on YouTube. So I'm hoping that after doing this review, he might get some more views and more downloads. Because these tracks are really nice. They're nice and he put a lot of work into these. They're nice and smooth and consistent. Um, going on this turn, there's a satellite thing that you pass, which is kind of cool. But this just about ends our video. So, um, I hope you liked it. The game variant is one lap mongoose. Map variant is read the description and creator boy to milkman.